Can I actually zoom in? No. Tell the story. <sighs> this is a story that happened to me about two years ago. And I want to tell you guys what happened. Now, before I get to the sad part, I want to tell you guys about someone that I used to know, which. His name is John, about a couple of years old, and he used to be nice to me. He was like a dad to me. Well, he's not a dad to me anymore. He's actually someone that, he's a friend of mine. He used to bring me tons of cars. One time he actually brought me a whole bin of cars, like, like toy cars. I used to like toy cars back then. In 2015. Now, I'm gonna tell you guys, he was actually, he was actually, um, he was pretty nice. He's about a couple, he was about 60, 70 years old. He had a brother, and he used to have a restaurant that currently have to be burned down. <sighs> the I actually came out with this idea by someone actually having to make a video basically for its bad news. Casey Neistat's uh, Morton's sister died, passed away last week. Which didn't seem all that emotional at first because I thought because um it wasn't basically about that wasn't not me but but I wanna tell you guys that one day in two thousand fifteen, I believe either November thirtieth or the week um the first week of December my mom gave me some news. No, it was before my mom gave me some news before, like, the week after the week that we were supposed to be out of school. It was December, and my mom told me that John was dying. Now, I thought they were kidding at first. I started laughing, and then my mom said, no, it's not funny. But then, when I went on to bed... I was crying to hell. Like, I was crying bad. Like, he was about a couple of years old and he had cancer, which that meant he was gonna die at some point, which I didn't get what cancer meant. I didn't know it was a disease. But then, until that point, I actually knew what cancer was that it was a disease that would kill you. At this point that I'm, John actually passed away, like he, and the week, the day before we actually left for Christmas break, I decided to make a poster, which actually had my name, um, some of my friends' names on it for a, for him. We decided to make, we did, I was crying, I was emotional, and um, at that point, I needed to make a poster for him to pray to God. He was, he died at, um, he died, probably. well, my mom told me that he's dying, and then he currently died on December 7th, 2015. And he, he was the best guy that I ever knew. He was, he was the guy that 
actually gave me some my gave some of his stuff for free. Hey, that's my story that happened to him. At this day, it's been two. To, it's been one year since um the his death. And unfortunately, if I did have the poster, I would put it, like, on my bed. I'd probably, um, put it on there. Now, this is basically a true story. Bye.